was used to try to recover the missing time of this individual. Um, and we got the classic um, answers from this person, there's no doubt about it being an abduction involved. And it all went from that particular direction. Now, sceptics and debunkers, of course, would continue to maintain that all such accounts of so-called alien abductions are foolish nonsense. How would you counter these? Well, first of all, it was the sceptics and debunkers that said that the world was flat for 300 years, uh, despite um, some of the top scientists of the time saying it was round. It's very, very easy for a sceptic or debunker to turn around and say uh, to people who've done years and years of research, this is absolute rubbish. It's very, very easy. This is what they do all the time. And of course, when we say, well, you, you prove to me uh, that what I'm saying is rubbish, and they all will turn around and say, well, it's not for us to prove that you're right. Uh, it's, it, it's not for us to prove that you're wrong. It's for you to prove that you're right. And uh, so we're always going to be faced with this thing. And as much information as you put before these people, they will do their best to pull it to pieces. Um, but the facts are the facts, um, particularly uh, if we talk about things like um, alien ab 